Hello everybody, it's Jess here with Blush Jess. Thank you so much for watching. I am headed out to go do my weekly grocery shopping and I'm going to share with you my meal plan before I head to the store. It is a beautiful, like this is like the prettiest day that we've had in a long time. It's like 65 degrees, it's beautifully sunny. Dave and I have taken the whole day, it's a Monday that I'm filming this, and we've just laid around and done absolutely nothing today, and it's been so much needed after our crazy weekend and weeks leading up to that weekend. So I do need to go to the store. Normally I go during the day, it's now almost four o'clock, and I need to go and get back um, because it'll be dinner time, but I need to go to the store. We are out of milk, we are out of strawberries, we are out of goldfish, like our staple things that the kids need. Dave and I did get a HelloFresh box, so I actually have everything I'm going to show you right now, what the meals we got from HelloFresh and our meal plan. And then I think I'm just going to go to Walmart because I'm very short on time. If I go to Aldi, I'll also have to go to Walmart, so I'm just going to cut out the two stops, pay a little bit more, and just get everything at Walmart. I also need a lot of like non-food items, uh, like we're out of dryer sheets, and I have to have a certain kind and all that, so just gonna go to um, Walmart so let me show you what I have planned for this week you guys know that we love HelloFresh and this is not sponsored at all but we really really love HelloFresh and we got a box and so let me show you the meals that we have for this week so this is probably what I'm making tonight tacos tacos are like the easiest meal ever and this is one that I never would order from HelloFresh because I thought I can make tacos like how much better could they be yeah they're really <laughs> <laughs> They're one of our favorite meals now from HelloFresh. These are the Southwestern beef tacos with bell pepper, lime crema, and pepper jack cheese. These are one of my favorites. They're really, really good. So we have this. Um, and if you don't know what HelloFresh is, basically they just send you all the ingredients pre-measured. It makes dinner time so easy. And the quality of the ingredients are so much better than even stuff like you get at the grocery store. Okay, another night we're going to have these cheesy stuffed barbecue pork burgers with charred pineapple and sweet potato fries oh my gosh does that not sound good I might actually switch this and do beef burgers and pork tacos I love pork tacos so I might do that instead of the beef tacos I like to play around um, but either way they're gonna be delicious and then the last one this is one we haven't tried before the little ears pasta with Italian pork sausage broccoli and pesto doesn't that look good and so that's our last meal if you guys are ever interested in trying out hello fresh for your first week you can get a box for a, a box just like we got for three meals two people for only twenty dollars you get forty dollars off with my link down below again it is not sponsored but we appreciate when you use the link it helps us out um, getting some credit with them and so we can get some of our favorite yummy delicious meals and it really helps us stay on our budget and um, you guys get a great deal as well by getting a whole box of food for 20 bucks. So that link will be linked down below. So let me show you the meal plan for this week. I did print this off. I designed this um, printable and actually I have it available for you guys. I'll link it down below. I've linked it before um, and some of you may have missed it, but it's really, it's really handy. It just has the days of the week. You can just print it out and just write it in or I like to just add it um, on, in PicMonkey and then uh, print out. But either way, printable is linked down below as a Google, it's like a Google document. Um, so tonight we're having the HelloFresh tacos. Tuesday we're having the pasta from HelloFresh. Wednesday I'm gonna do taco soup. I know you guys, I have a taco soup and chili problem. It is not chili in taco soup weather, but we love it. We love it year-round, and I love that I can make a huge pot of it, and we have it for leftovers, we have it for lunches. I haven't made it in probably three weeks or more and so I've been wanting it so we're gonna I'm gonna do that on Wednesday night before church and then we can just heat it up when we get home Thursday we're having the HelloFresh burgers Friday I'm gonna do some spaghetti squash I have been thinking about my um it's like a parmesan garlic sp spinach spaghetti squash I, I've showed you guys lots of times um on dinner videos I make it all the time but it's been a long time since I made it and I was actually thinking about it a lot this week and then somebody also mentioned it in our live video and I thought you know what yes I'm gonna put that on the menu so it's on Friday Saturday oh you know what I forgot to look up the ingredients for this I need to google that real quick I was busy while I was making my list and I forgot to get the ingredients I found a potato soup recipe for um 
the pressure cooker for the Instapot. So I'm going to look up that recipe and also get the things I need for that. And then Sunday we just have leftovers. We just have whatever we have left over. We'll either have that or something really fast like a sandwich or just really simple on Sunday night. So that is the plan. Um, I've got my grocery list here. We're going to head to Walmart. And then when I get home, I will show you everything I get to, you know, get us through this week. So come along with me and I'll see you guys when I get home. All right, you guys. So it's a little bit of a different angle than I normally do. I'm trying to get the whole table here. Um, I went to Walmart, like I was telling you guys, and I think I got a lot for my money. I spent like a hundred and two or three dollars, something like that. hundred and three dollars. I got a ton of stuff. It's all over the table and spilling into the back. So I'm going to try to show you real quick. And so, um, I also got some packages and somebody sent Lucy a sky blanket and they, some hedgehog balls. Thank you so much, Don and Sandy. Well, sh I'll show you those in a minute. Uh, thank you so much, Don and Sandy. Lucy, can you say thank you? Thank yeah. yeah. Okay. That was so nice. It's such a nice surprise. Look, daddy's going to open it up and show us. Pause on the grocery haul. That is a huge blanket. Oh my goodness. It's Sky and Everest and Chase. Oh my goodness, Lucy. That is so big. <laughs> I think it's too big to take to school. I think you have to put it on your bed or have a picnic on it. That'd be cool. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Thank you so much. That was so nice. Okay. I've got to hurry and show you guys because it's dinner time. I need to make the kids dinner, but here we go. We're going to. Okay. All right. So let's get started. Um, the kids need more of their mini pancakes. These are the ones they like. The D Waffle Baker buttermilk pancakes. So we need more of those. We also. It's buttermilk. You like them. It's the ones I buy all the time. I also got them some original French toast sticks, some honey breast tenders. These are their favorite, the Tyson honey breast tenders. I'm sorry, you guys. Layla's barking at people working on our roof. Um, these are so good. The deli style wedges. I haven't bought them in a few weeks, and they just sounded good. They're like $1.66, and they're like the kind that you get at the deli. But when you cook them in the air fryer, they're even better than the ones in the deli. They're so good. Two pounds for $1.66. I think that's a great deal. I got some, just some regular white bread for grilled cheese sandwiches and stuff for the kids. For my taco soup that I'm going to make, I got the <laughs> corn chips and this time I got the dipper ones. So just a little different. I love this kale slaw and it's been a while since I bought it. So, <laughs> oh Lord, it's about to get real in here. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Um, I love the kale slaw. It's been a while since I bought it, so I got some of that. Okay, and then I got some of this Brick Oven Red Baron pizza. This is our favorite pizza. It is so good. If you have not tried this, you definitely should. It is amazing. And today, I usually get the cheese because Lucy likes the cheese, but Nate really likes the pepperoni, so I thought maybe we could pick it off for her, but he likes the pepperoni, so I got that. Um, I got Nate a couple of yogurts. So this is the Oikos orange creamy orange cream he really likes those so i got two of those and i got two of the yo play vanilla yogurt they didn't have any of the great value vanilla or i've got that i got a big spaghetti squash for that spaghetti spinach alfredo kind of thing whatever it's called <laughs> this is for my potato soup i needed an onion i got some spinach for the spaghetti squash i got a two percent milk some ground beef that is for the chili or taco soup. Um, we needed some more baby carrots. They had Driscoll strawberries. These were not cheap. They were still like $6 for two pounds, but we love Driscoll strawberries. They are so amazing. So I splurged and got them. Got some more bananas. They looked really good. We like them when they're just like this, a little bit green. They're perfect for us. Uh, Mom life. I treated myself to a new sponge. This is one that's my favorite, the scrub daddy one. So I got a new one of those. I have to replace it every once in a while because they kind of wear off, wear down a little bit. We needed both kinds of dryer sheets. So I used the all free and clear on the kids stuff. Um, and then if I wash only David and I's alone or our sheets or something, I like the gain ones. I got the gain moonlight breeze this time. And then we were out of toothpaste. So I got the aqua fresh extra fresh and whitening. David needed a body wash. So I got him the suave. Suave Men Refresh Hydrating Body Wash. 
And then I, I bought these a while ago and they were really good and I haven't seen them again. Um, so I saw them and I thought, hey, they weren't cheap. They're like $5 or something crazy. But they're the Lumpy Bumpy Naturally Sweet Gold Nugget Mandarins. They're a little bit bigger than like Halos, um, but they were really good the last time we tried them. So we're going to try those again. Um, <laughs> I got some mild cheddar cheese and then I got Lucy another pack of her favorite mixed berry cereal bars. We still have Nate's. So she needed some more. And then I got a variety of cans. So I got two. Uh, <laughs> I'll go ahead and open these. Okay. She's going to help me. I got two of the tomato sauces. That's for this taco soup. And then one of the diced tomatoes with green chilies. That is for the taco soup. Red beans, black beans, and pinto beans. I'm going to make a huge pot, so I need a bunch of beans for the taco soup. And I thought I would do a mixture. Usually I just do pinto and black, but I thought I'd add a can of the red beans as well. For the potato soup, there's lots of soups for it to be getting hot. I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, <laughs> uh, great value cream of chicken. That's for the potato soup. David asked for some more instant breakfast. I haven't bought these in forever, but he was wanting them. So we buy the instant breakfast light star. It's the no sugar added ones. Lucy asked for um, party cakes, muffins. So I got those for her. And then I also got us, um, or really for the kids, these sour cream and onion Pringles. I needed chicken broth for the potato soup. Of course, we had milk. I told you guys that. Spinach. I think I told you everything on the table. So let's move to the chairs. Everything's spilling over. <laughs> Lucy's favorite is the Kool-Aid Jammers Sharkleberry Fin. She's helping me put everything away. And then we were completely out of goldfish, so I got another pack, huge pack of the goldfish colors. We needed paper towels. This is my favorite from Great Value Brand, the Ultra Strong Split Sheets. Huge rolls. Bag of potatoes for that soup. And then we needed toilet paper. I really like the Scott Comfort Plus. Um, it's a little bit thicker than regular Scott, but not quite as thick as Charmin. I just think that's a little bit too thick. Just my opinion. But anyway, <laughs> so that is it for this grocery haul. I'm going to get everything put away. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I, As I was filling up my cart, I was thinking I was spending more money, but I really think I was able to keep it so low by buying so many great value items. I mean, we got a few name brand things, but a lot of it was great value. So definitely be watching for that um, when you're in the store. Um, I probably could have saved more going to Aldi, but for a one-stop shop, I think I did pretty good with all the prices and stuff. So that is going to be it for today. If you like this video, you know what to do. Give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Please subscribe if you're new. We will see you guys all later. Bye.